welcome viewers this is green gaya tarot and this is your november tarot prediction pick a card reading so take a deep breath think about your month of november and choose your option from pile number one two and three and we will begin from pile number one welcome pile number one this is your november tarot prediction pick a card reading let's see your cards your tarot cards are five of cups king of wands six of swords and ten of pentacles so in the month of november as we can see you need to focus on the present more rather than looking back to the past whatever was in the past no matter how precious painful or any kind of emotion there were it was in the past you need to let go let go of the attachment toxicity and find the blessings that you have in your life in the present and it will be wonderful for you you need to follow your passion with the king of wands and take the charge of your life your progress prosperity whatever you want you can shape your life that way only if you believe that you are empowered to do so your next card here is the six of swords so time will change as you change your mind and celebrate life more rather than looking back the final tarot card here is the ten of pentacles this is the card that tells that there will be abundance, prosperity, joyful moments with friends and family. You will celebrate life. There is plenty for you to enjoy more and wonderful life. So those were the tarot for you, pile number one. Let's see what we have for you in the Oracle cards. Your first card here is... You are very close to achieving your goals. Well, that's wonderful to know that whatever struggle, whatever hardship you were doing, it's about to be fruitful and you will find your goal and you will find your rewards soon. Your next card here is Prosperity Lies Ahead. We already got the glimpse of that from the Ten of Pentacles and now it's the assurance from the Oracle 2 that the prosperity lies ahead. Let's see what else do we have here. We have adjacent possibilities. So there will be surprising multiple possibilities coming your way and you are heading towards them. It's time for you to explore and achieve what you wanted always let's see what else is sorry what else is here you got the cornucopia well this card came after a while and this is the card that tells that there will be so so much for you to celebrate in the month of november let's see what else we have here you got overcome any obstacles so there is the might the strength the ability the boldness in you to overcome any and every obstacle that might be coming in and you are so much empowered to handle all that by yourself you are unstoppable there is nothing that can stop your progress here let's see what else you got time to collaborate so partnership collaboration is here you will be co-creating a better and brighter and wonderful future you will find someone who has similar ideas inspiration and together you will create something wonderful let's see your next card round and round this is the card that again tells you to close the gate on those five of cups 
close the gate on the past you need to free yourself break the similar patterns whatever was going on round and round you need to break free to achieve these wonderful results your final card here is go the distance you are empowered in every way to achieve all that you always dreamed of planned for and prepared for so move forward pile number one this was your november tarot prediction pick a card reading if you liked my reading please continue supporting my channel with like share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great november welcome pile number two this is your november tarot prediction pick a card reading let's see what we have for you in the tarot Your first card is Nine of Swords. Next you have the Two of Wands. Then you have the Eight of Cups. Next you have the Empress. And the final card is the Judgment. So, pile number two. The important month for you for sure with the Nine of Swords. There is a lot of anxious energy regarding this month. In your part that I can tell but being anxious is not the way for you to achieve answers or anything from this month if you want answers you need to look for them knowledge clear communication will be your path to proceed forward and with the two of wands it's time for you to get out of your comfort zone to explore opportunities this two of wands is asking for you to get up, move forward. And the very next card is eight of cups. So yes, there will be a strong need for you to proceed on an unknown journey, on an unknown path. And that will bring in a lot of new things for you that will be directly related to more abundance, new beginnings. You will reap the rewards of your hard work but for that you need to take charge judgment will be here changing major chapters in your life will be there those blessed changes are happening by the divine's blessings you need to be prepared for those major events november will give you so much if you are ready to receive them these were your tarot cards let's see what we have for you in the auto ones your first card here is a time to give rather than take so being generous is something that you need to do in this month for sure if you have plenty definitely share this can be sharing knowledge this can be sharing good fortune wealth whatever it is that is needed for you to share is something that you need to consider there might be plenty for you to celebrate life that you can share with someone who will be in need of those things situations opportunities for their basics let's see what we have for you in the next card take time to breathe out this is the card that tells you to relax a bit there is a lot on your plate don't neglect your health if you are here to achieve new things there will be a requirements of hard work to work hard focus better proper rest rejuvenation will be needed mm. let's see what we have for you in the next card the next card here is balance spirituality and practicality this is the card that tells you you need to have it the right balance will be your key to success you need to have the practical knowledge you need to have the spiritual guidance and strength if you need pray meditate and ask the divine to guide you if you need you need to imply your experience and your hard-earned knowledge 
into implementation of the work that requires that knowledge. Let's see what else we have here. Your next card here is Dot Romance. So there will be love. Love will be there. Celebrate it. Enjoy good times with friends and family and celebrate the life's joyous moment. Let's see what else is there. You have Strategy. This is the card that tells it's high time you plan ahead, strategize, multitask, time manage. Mint will be your priorities. Things that are needs your attention, prioritize them and definitely move forward with a solid plan and strategy. Let's see what else is there. The next card is Let It Shine. You need to let your true light shine. Don't hide. Don't settle for anything less. Don't box your ideas to follow any trend or fashion. So that will be your true blessings. Let's see what else we have. Love is all around. We already got that message earlier also. Love will be all around and you will be needing to follow the path of love share the love share the kindness let's see the next card you got multiple cards extra cards watch and wait so don't rush major changes needs you to focus better because if you don't you might miss some situation things that are valuable so watch and wait Let's see what we have for you next. All that glitters. I was telling you, you need to focus better when things are changing because there are things, situations, people that can be masked as something wonderful and they are not. So take care. Be careful. Final card here is Chop Wood. This is the card that tells it's high time you appreciate what you have and clear space for new things in your life in your work situation all around you because as you create new space for new things new things will appear and you will be getting rid of old and worn out situations so pile number two this was your november tarot prediction pre card reading if you like my reading please continue supporting my channel with like share subscribe and comment Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great November. Welcome pile number three. This is your November Tarot Prediction Pick a Card Reading. Let's see what are your cards in the Tarot. You got the Page of Wands. Next you have the Ace of Cups. Then you have the Ten of Pentacles. And the final card is the Four of Wands. With the Page of Wands, there is a strong need for you to have an enthusiastic approach towards life, towards your passion project, towards everything. If you are not feeling the right vibe yet, what if, do something that ignites the passion in you or gives you the cool breeze of inspiration. If you need to have a walk by the ocean, do it, a walk in the park, can do it also or simply some moments of peace and quiet whatever it is you need to try it to have that with the very next card being the ace of cups it's time for you to follow the path of love creativity and intuition it will do open doors for you opportunities will be there with abundance because the very next card is also the Ten of Pentacles, the card that shows you that there will be a lot of good fortune, abundance, financial wealth, material wealth, and stability. The final card here is the Four of Wands. So in the month of November, you will begin a journey that will withstand all the struggles and challenges that might come in the future because this is something that is blessed 
by the divine and it is here to stay so these were your tarot cards let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards your first card here is a fiery climax approaches so there might be some kind of results coming or some endings that were much needed will be here in the month of november your next card is the end of a tough cycle approaches so yes there will be the end of a tough cycle that will come whatever struggle was there you will be done with it soon let's see what else we have here the next card here is a win-win outcome is forecast so yes it is about time when you will see that you are on the winning streak no matter what happens you are going to win no matter how the odds will work you will be the winner let's see what we have for you here next you have the yin and yang this is the card that tells you there might be a situation where you find a union happening in favor of you there will be the required balance that will be established in your life there will be the need of you acting and receiving the rewards for your acts so there is the right time and the right moment that is here you will see the next card is hostilities this is the card that tells you to stand your ground voice your truth because it's a time for you to establish that you will prioritize your well-being rather than serving others in their requirements and neglecting yourself let's see what else we have here your next card here is sing your own song yes when no one is there to do it for you you need to do it by yourself and you are the most responsible person for your well-being and your progress so you need to sing your song don't let other people tell you what to do and how to do it your next card here is now is a lucky time so lucky rabbit is telling you luck is on your side don't wait for anything else don't wait for anyone else you need to proceed forward with this good time and opportunities your next card here is not for you so if there are things that you think was not meant for you it was not meant for your good because sometimes we don't see things and we don't see future so we don't see what those glittery wrapped up gifts we think they are they might be something really bad for you and now you have to understand the universe is protecting you by denying those glittery wrapped papers and gift that you think were appropriate for you but you are not getting it let's see the final card for you you have to the sea this is the card that tells that there are things that you are unable to see at this point but you need to follow the path forward as you are guided to do so by the divine yes it is kind of challenging difficult and uncomfortable for you to follow the change but it will reward you in time and stop looking back so much you need to follow the universal flow now so pile number three this was your november tarot prediction pick a card reading if you like my reading please continue supporting my channel with like share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great november so viewers this was your november tarot prediction pick a card reading it w it's a bit early for me to give the monthly reading but i missed out on october prediction and i might miss the opportunity for doing this reading in the future so i just chose today to do it tell me if you like it 
and definitely show the love if you like it. Thank you everyone again. Have a great day. Have a great November.